Hello everybody and welcome to a little video I decided to make because I got a question um, on YouTube of how to basically set the resolution options of Victoria 2 because you can't really do much in the options menu in the game. And how you do this is you need to go to your documents and in your documents there will be a folder called Paradox Interactive which is where all your Paradox games are stored. You can see I've got Crusader Kings 2 and Victoria 2. Inside Victoria 2 this is uh, your map cache, which sometimes you'll need to delete if it gets messed up. Your save games, screenshots, logs, graphical effects, flag files. So this is all, if you want to mod the game, this is very useful. Console history, message types, and settings. If we open settings and expand it, I'm not sure why it's that small. These are all the settings you get. So you can see right now, I have it set to 1920 by 1080. Full screen equals yes. Now I can just, to change it, simply full screen equals no. I can set a different resolution, I can set shadows on or off, I can put multi-sampling on, volume I can do here, simple water, you know, last player is equal, is named player, uh, server address if I'm playing multiplayer, how much I auto save, and that's just, you know, a quick little message sort of to tell you how to do all this stuff, and you can also change the language here, which I didn't, haven't noticed until just now. But yeah, if you want to play it in window mode so you can also work or do whatever, because that's how I normally play it, then this is how you do it. So thank you for watching and hope this has helped.